hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of x if we have x plus 2 to the power of 4 and its whole square root is equals to 2 and we solve this problem for the values of x so here first we find all the roots of this equation and at the last we will check that which of the roots are solution and which of the roots are extraneous root of this equation so uh, i hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section and now here the very first thing we are going to do is here first you know that how to uh, write the radical expression into the exponential form we know that if you have square root of a we write it as a to the power of 1 over 2 as well as here we use another exponential formula you know about that if we have a to the power of m to the power of n is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so here we need uh, these two nice uh, exponential uh, which we can apply here into the left hand side so here first we apply this uh, we and we convert our express our equation into the uh, exponential form so for this we write it as x plus 2 to the power of 4 and its whole power is 1 over 2 is equals to 2 and further here we use this nice exponential law and according to this exponential law we need to multiply these two exponents and after multiplication of these two exponents it will be written as x plus 2 to the power of 4 multiplied by 1 over 2 is equals to 2 and now you see here these are cancelled out by each other and we get here 2 times 2 becomes 4 and further we have this is x plus 2 whole square is equals to 2 and now here further uh, we need uh, to solve this equation uh, so so that here we just apply the nice algebraic formula into the left hand side and you know about that if we have a plus b whole square is equals to uh, a square plus 2 times of a b plus b square so we use here this nice algebraic formula into the left hand side after applying this formula our left hand side is written as a square plus 2 times of a b so here our a is x and b is 2 plus b square so b is 2 square and this whole equation is equals to 2 and now further in the next step we have this is x square plus this is 2 times of 2 becomes 4x plus this 2 square equals to 4 and we move this 2 into the left hand side and it will becomes minus 2 and this whole equation is equals to 0. And now further in the next step we need more simplifications and it will be written as x square plus 4x plus this is 4 minus 2 becomes here 2 and this whole equation is equals to 0. And now we use here the nice uh, quad uh, uh, the nice quadratic formula to solve this quadratic equation so for this first we need to write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a is equals to 1 b is equals to 4 and c is equals to 2 and we state the quadratic formula as x is equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a so this is the our quadratic formula uh, and now we substitute the above values of a b and c here and after substituting this it will be written as first we have minus b the value of b is 4 plus minus square root of this is b square and b is 4 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is 2 and it is divided by 2 times of a and here our a is equals to 1 and now further in the next step we have our x is equals to this is minus 4 plus minus square root of this is 4 square and 4 square equals to 16 minus this is 4 times of 2 becomes 8 and it is divided by 2 
and now further we need more simplifications and it will be written as minus 4 plus minus square root of 16 minus 8 becomes 8 and it is divided by 2 and now here in the next step we need more simplifications and it will be written as x is equals to minus 4 plus minus here we write this 8 as 4 multiplied by 2 and it is divided by 2 so further we have x is equals to minus 4 plus minus here we know that square root of 4 becomes 2 into square root of 2 and also we break this fraction and we write this 2 separately on both of these values so you get here this is 2 times of 2 is 4 this 2 is cancelled out by this 2 and uh, further we have the values of x are minus 2 plus minus square root of 2. So we get here uh, these are the uh, two roots of the given equation which we get here and now in the further steps we need to verify these two roots and we will check that uh, which of the roots are uh, solution or which of the roots are extraneous roots so for this we need to copy down given question statement here it is x plus 2 to the power of 4 and its whole square root is equals to 2 and now first uh, here uh, we will be verify the positive value it is minus 2 plus square root of 2 in this side uh, we verify the negative value it is minus 2 minus square root of 2 so here we verify both of these values now first we put this value of x into the left hand side of the given equation after substituting this it will be written as square root of uh, first we have x plus 2 the value of x is minus 2 plus square root of 2 and this is plus 2 and its whole power is 4 and we check that is this equals to 2 or not so first we solve this case after that we move towards the second case uh, and now you see here this is the positive and negative 2 are gone and we will get here square root of square root of 2 to the power of 4 is equals to 2 now here first we write this into the exponential form and it will be written as square root of 2 uh, to the power of 4 multiplied by 1 over 2 we write this square root into the 1 over 2 form and we check that is this equals to 2 or not so you cancel this term this is 2 times of 2 becomes 4 uh, and this 2 and this square root are also gone and we get here only 2 is equals to 2 so this shows that the first value of x is satisfied our given question statement now we check that our second value of x so we put this value here it will be written as square root of x plus 2 the value of x is minus 2 minus square root of 2 plus 2 to the power of 4 and we check that is this equals to 2 or not and again you see that these two are gone and we will get here minus square root of 2 and its whole power is 4 is equals to 2 so this square root and this are gone and uh, we will get here minus square root of 2 and its whole square is equals to 2 and now the minus square become positive and this 2 and square root are gone and we will get here 2 is equals to 2 this shows that the second value of x is also satisfied our given question statement and this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos